Benjamin Dyer gives you some well-deserved respect here. And he says, why are you such a great wrestler? And yet most people still underrate you. Your moves are top shelf and you're one tough cookie. Well, I appreciate that. Um, I guess because I look like their neighbor. That's what I hear more than anything. You know, really, it's like, he looks like a sixth grade to school teacher. And, you know, he just looks like a normal guy. And it's, you know, in our business, 6'1", 250 is not a monster. That's a mid, mid-size. Right. I mean, when you got Big Show walking around and Kane and Taker and Vader and you got all these guys walking around, you know, pushing seven feet tall and 400 pounds and, you know, the Road Warriors, the Steiners, Steve Williams. Think about all the monsters, you know, Haku, all those guys. Oh, big boys. Yeah. Yeah. And uh, I just think that once the bell rings, they see that. I think Eric Bischoff said it. Arn Anderson has more ways to break more bones than anybody in professional wrestling. I think mm. he said that one day on a commentary and that's what you had once the bell rang the sixth grade school teacher had rabies and it kicked in right <laughs> and what did bobby heenan say didn't he say you were an olympic wrestler or like you you should remember that we watched it a few weeks ago could, Arn could wrestle in the olympics but then he <laughs> turned around and he said that about somebody else the next week remember? i know i know Oh man. 